this video considers uh, another uh, simple problem on the electromagnetic theory. Uh, basically, uh, uh, this problem is based on the uh, polarization of the uh, wave and uh, this problem is uh, stated as a plane wave is characterized by E equals to this 0.5 x unit vector plus y unit vector e to by j pi by 2 e to by j omega t minus j k z. This is the electric field given and we have to find that uh, uh, whether the wave is polarized linearly, circularly, elliptically or unpolarized. So we have to find the polarization of the wave in this particular problem. What have we observed from this problem is the electric field is given and this electric field has both x and y components. That means the electric field is uh, in the x direction also and the electric field is also in the y direction. And so the direction of propagation of the wave is the z direction is the direction of propagation of the wave. So we can uh, write these uh, electric field components, uh, the x component and the y component and after finding E, X and E, Y component, we will try to find out that uh, what are their amplitudes and uh, depending upon the amplitudes of these waves, the polarization of the wave will be decided. So we can write the value for E, X. That means the X uh, component of the electric field we can write here like 0.5 uh, x x is the unit vector uh, and the other part is e to the power j omega t minus k Z. We have put this into bracket and this is the X component of wave. We can write the Y component of the electric field as 1, this is e to the power j pi by 2 e to the power j omega t minus k z. So this is the electricity field component and this is in the y direction. So this is the unit vector for y direction. Now uh, we know both the electric field components in x and y direction. We can take ratio of this component E x oblique over E y the components. Uh, this ratio comes as 0.5 into this factor will cancel out and this will give me e to the power minus j pi over 2. This could be written as half is the magnitude and this is minus 90 degrees. That means this is the magnitude part and this is the phase part of the electric field uh, components in x and y directions. Now we can find the ratio of uh, these components and their magnitude, ratio of their magnitudes. What we find here is this ratio is of uh, their magnitude is basically this is half which is not equal to 1. That means both the amplitudes of electric field in x and y directions they are not the same. Since they are not same the wave is not circularly polarized 
the wave is elliptically polarized so this option that the wave is elliptically polarized is the right option since since if the wave had been uh, circularly polarized the amplitude ratio of the electric and electric field in x and y direction should have been same since that ratio is half which is not same so the wave is not circularly polarized and the wave is elliptically polarized so this is the right option thank you